up flower squad welcome back to my channel it's lit it's lit today is a good day i am just such i'm in such a good mood like uh, y'all last night i turned in my last college assignment i'm out of there bye i'm done and i am so freaking happy so I took my hair down after my graduation pictures and I decided let me bring you guys a video. Why not? I got time, I got all the time in the world now. <laughs> I'm gonna bring you guys a video on how to properly remove your wig braids. Now, when I show y'all my hair, don't be clowning me, okay? People like to text me or snap me and say stuff and ain't nothing funny. I don't show people my wig braids, so don't be clowning me. All right, they look a little rough under there. They look like a, I don't even know, I'm scared. I'm scared, I don't wanna show y'all. <laughs> so look. We about to take these braids down. I miss my hair so much, y'all. Like, I'm just ready to play in my hair again. My hair has been itching like crazy. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how to properly remove your wig braids so that you don't have a lot of tearing, you don't have a lot of tangling or snatches. So let's get into it. For this braid removal, you're going to need hot water or warm water, whatever you prefer. I prefer, I prefer hot water. And conditioner mixed together, just shake it up. This is what I'm gonna use my water base. And you're gonna need some conditioner. And I'm using my Izzy Moist 3 Minute Miracle. To me, it doesn't really matter which conditioner you use of course don't use a cheap conditioner but you don't have to use your best conditioner to remove your braids but i'm going to use the three minute miracle moist today so let's get started oh yeah you need to come so what i do first is i just find me one braid to focus on at a time i usually don't have this many braids but when I was wearing this wig, it was a straight hair wig, so I wanted it to lay super flat. That's why I have so many braids. So you want to begin by, so you want to begin by spraying your braids. Saturate the braid. Don't be afraid to get it really wet. Saturate the braid. Then you want to take a little of your conditioner. Just a little bit and rub it down the braid just really get it in there and after you've done all that you can begin taking your braid down okay that first comb was not working with those with these thin braids so I suggest you use one of these. Now, as I took this braid down, I had no snagging, nothing. Of course, I had a little shedding from this braid. I don't even know if you can see it. I had a little shedding. And I'm going to show you guys the amount of shedding that I have at the end because, yes, when you take your wig braids down, you are going to have shedding. I get so sad every time my hair sheds, but 
it's natural. Don't be alarmed. So after I take one braid down, I take my shower comb and I just detangle. And it's not really, it's really not even much to detangle. My comb is just gliding through. And that's because I added the water and conditioner at the beginning. Usually if you take down dry braids, it's just gonna be so tough to detangle. It's a whole hassle that you don't even need. And I'm gonna use this clip to just clip this out of the way while I start on the next braid. And you wanna do the same thing, just continue to repeat the process. Saturate your braid. Really saturate it to a little conditioner. This is the time where you use a suggested dime size amount. This is the only time <laughs> I use the suggested dime size amount. When I do this process, taking down my braids is gonna fly so quick. So much quicker. Slow down. After each braid, I like to add in the hair that I have previously taken down and just detangle that all together. Then I pin it up, move on to the next braid. Just continue to do the same process until you are finished. It's going to be easy, I promise much easier than hassling with tangled dry hair. This, this is what you want. You want healthy curls to come back after you take your braids down. You don't want your hair to be all dry, matted, tangled, and just snagging the whole time. That was That's what causes hair loss. And we don't want hair loss, sis. We're trying to grow over here. We're trying to grow our inches. We don't need hair loss. So I'm gonna come back to you guys when I'm in my last braid, just to show you one last time how I'll just do everything and how I section it all off. So, I'll be back when this is almost done. Last one.
Okay, that is how I safely remove my wig braids. I had minimal shedding. I'm about to show you guys the amount of shedding I had in one second. But can we get into these curls though? Get into it. Oh, it feels so good to have my hair back. Y'all just don't understand. Oh, gosh. <laughs> it feels so freaking good. I cannot wait to wash my hair. <sighs> oh, my goodness. My hair is entangled. It's not dry, it's not matted. My curls are popping as they should, okay? <sighs> okay, now I'm about to show y'all the shedding I had. It wasn't much. It actually was less than what I thought. So this is the amount of shedding I had taking my braids down. This is nothing to me. <laughs> I've had more that was scary, okay? I've had more. But you will, this, this looks like a little fro that can go on a doll or something. I hate seeing it, but your hair will shed and it's okay. Especially if you had your wig braids in for a while, it's okay, your hair is gonna shed. Do not panic, okay? Don't panic. But yes, let me know if you guys use this routine if you do let me know how it works for you all and yeah i'm about to go wash my hair if you have not seen my wash day routine yet go back and watch it after you finish this video okay sis all right i'm gonna be dropping some flavor for y'all as much as i can i'm not even gonna lie to as much as i can i'm dropping the videos for y'all okay one love favorite squad make sure you like this video make sure you comment down below let me know what you think about this routine make sure you hit the subscribe button before you leave mm -hmm. the subscribe button right there i know you see it hit the subscribe button before you leave and mm. uh. Now, with that being said, Flavor Squad, may your curls pop and your grind never stop. Your girl is out of here. <laughs> out of here.